Happy Tuesday. Art informs. Art comes in different forms. And life is art. Those aren't new concepts. Maybe they're new to you. Maybe you've never heard them in that order before. I mean, I love the rearrangement of words. I love the idea that, you know, art informs is has two different meanings. But I think, and I'm not original in saying this, I don't know who first said it, but life is art. We create, and to, to create, you are an artist. You have power. We have power. I mean, there are certainly times that I feel powerless and I feel like a victim. I don't like feeling that way. Um, and I work and I practice to get out of that mindset. But we are creators. We create our lives. We are not, we make choices. Whether that choice is to be passive and have the world impose and break us down and diminish us, that's a choice and that's power. Or you can actively pursue and be in action and do and create whatever you desire. You can, you can move towards that direction. Now, can you be anything you want? I, I, I don't know. Maybe. I mean, but we also live in the confines of this collective consciousness. I love the, to think of the idea that if the collective consciousness, if everybody thought that you could do anything you wanted, what would that look like? What would the freedom and the power what freedom and power would that give us as individuals, as creators, as co-creators of this world, of this universe? Would we be able to fly? I don't know. You know, I love that, to think about that, that the only reason we can't do certain things is because everybody has agreed that we can't. There are schools of thought and theories that if collectively we let go of that which we can't do, then we could do. I don't know. Pretty interesting. Art informs. Create it. Let's create our lives. Yay. <laughs> uh, much love.